Hey guys, what's up? It's Cameron here for Honest Exclusive Gaming, and today I'll be showing you how to install the single player commands mod for Minecraft Beta, or not, not Minecraft Beta, Minecraft 1.0.0. Um, so there's three things that you're going to need. You're going to need the single player commands mod right here. You're going to need Mod Loader, and you're also going to need WinRAR or 7-Zip, uh, so basically an archiving program. I'll put a link to WinRAR and 7-Zip down in the description below, as well as download links for these two files right here. Alright, so when you first download them it's really easy you don't I'm not going to show you how to do that but after you download them you're going to want to right click on both of them and hit extract all and then it should put them into these type of folders right here so extract both of those from zip folders uh, into open folders because you're going to need to drag files out of here um, so once you've done that then you don't need these zip folders anymore you can just put those off to the side you're just going to need these open folders right here Alright, so you should have the mod loader open folder and single player commands open folder. Now head down into your start menu and type in percent app data percent in the search bar and hit enter. And it should pop up with your roaming folder. Um, once you're there, click on your dot minecraft folder. It should be the first one. So just click on that and then you're going to want to head into your bin folder which should be also be the first one. Um, next, head down to the second to last file which is your minecraft executable jar file. Right click on that and hit open with WinRAR. Uh, so this is where you're going to need 7-zip or WinRAR so make sure to have one of those and just right click on the Minecraft thing and it should open up the Minecraft.jar. Um, so once you're in here the first thing that you're going to do is locate this meta INF folder it should be all in capital letters just click or right click on that and go to delete files and hit yes. Um, that just prevents mods from actually working so you're going to want to make sure that that's gone or this thing will not work for you. Okay so once you've done that go into your mod loader folder and grab all the class files in there and drag them over to your Minecraft jar folder and hit OK. It should drag them all over there and now you're done with that. Um, next go to your single player commands folder and you're going to want to drag everything in there except for this readme folder. So delete that readme folder out of there. It's not that important. And you're not going to want to put in this world edit folder which is a executable jar file. So make sure to grab everything, all the class files in there except for that executable jar file which is called like world edit. Alright, so once you drag all the class files over to your minecraft.jar, just like you did for mod loader, you can exit out of your jar folder, and you can go back into your bin folder, um, and you're going to want to drag in the minecraft world edit into there. So just drag that over to your bin, uh, where basically where your minecraft executable jar file was, just drag in the world edit, and now you should be done. So let's go ahead and open up minecraft. And oh, before I open it up, I do want to mention that if your meta INF folder isn't deleting, it's probably because your Minecraft is still open. So make sure Minecraft is closed the entire time you install this. Um, so open up Minecraft like you usually would. Uh, go to login. Uh, I'm going to create a new world. Uh, yeah, create world. Just to show you that the mod is working. And I did not get the black screen, so it should be working. Um, I'm not sure it might clash with a few different mods, but I have no mods installed right now, so it works for that. I know it works with too many items, uh, for sure. So if you have that installed, you should be good. And as you can see right there, single player commands is now working. So if I hit T, I can type in, and I'll type spawn chicken. And a chicken will spawn right there so as you can see the mod is working this is a great mod it's probably one of the best mods honestly for minecraft so i definitely recommend going to pick it up um so if this video helped you out uh please consider leaving a thumbs up down below as well as a comment uh bump this video up in the search box you know if you have any questions you can leave those down below as well and if you're new to my videos then it'd be great if you could subscribe because i upload mod tutorials and uh call of duty commentaries and stuff like that so please go ahead and subscribe and that's all i got for you in this video make sure to rate comment and subscribe and i'll catch you guys in my next video see ya